Happy New Year to you. I hope you have a really successful 2016. Um, I'd like to challenge you. I'd like to give you a bit of a challenge for the New Year because, you know, it's not going to be challenging enough. I'm sure you've already come up with some New Year's resolutions and if you haven't, if you deliberately don't do New Year's resolutions, then that's fair enough too. And uh, what I'm talking about is not really a resolution as much as it is about just being yourself. So getting to know who you are and really going for it and not apologizing for who you are. Just, you know, inspire other people to be themselves by you being yourself. It's amazing how much uh, tension and uh, miscommunication can be um, certainly avoided but also resolved uh, as a result of you just being and becoming yourself as who you are. Certainly, if you know my work, you know that I don't really go on about how bad things are in the world and so on because I, my focus is, is elsewhere. But um, I think especially coming into 2016 and the, to the end of kind of this particular um, um, couple of years, um, there's been a lot of change in the world and there's a lot of uh, people who are beginning to think a little bit differently than um, is perhaps the norm. Um, and I'd like to challenge you to find out for yourself this coming year and the years after this, to challenge you to find out for yourself what is actually the right thing. So that you don't just blindly follow what's being given to you. Find out who you are. Find out the value that you have to offer to this world and see how the world transforms just with the power of one. Just you. So that's my challenge for you for the new year. I hope to see so much more of what you're going to be creating and who you already are and who you are becoming. And uh, yeah, Happy New Year. I can't wait to see it.